Hey you guys, what up with it man? Had a long day man, me and my woman sitting here enjoying our shakes. She got chocolate, I got vanilla, you know, typical, you know, cause she like chocolate and I like vanilla, you guys. Oh, 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 oh. Yes sir. I mean, waiting on that food man here at Bronx, man, they got good, good food, bad service. Bad Everywhere service, man. Hurt. Hey, somebody want to say what was I talking about? Probably about taste. Hey, you guys, listen. I was sitting here chopping it up. And I remember ever since I was a kid, man, like, like my mom had me the way to where I would defend my siblings just being the youngest child, though. And one day, you guys, I guess it was just a bad day, man. This, this little boy, I used to always pick on my sister. And we're in the classroom. Teacher walks out. No, had no business sleeping first graders in the room by themselves. So, story goes, uh, yeah, man, I don't know what my what my sister did to the little boy, but um, he he was he was chasing him in the classroom with some scissors, like some real like they not in the little play for cut scissors, no safety scissors, no the real deal scissors with the blade. So. And at first I was chasing behind him. I'm trying to just grab him. They had braids at the time. They had cornrows stuff. I tried to grab him by his cornrows, but I could not catch him. They, they both was fast. They both grew up and was really good in track also. But besides the point, by, see, by the time the third or fourth lap, I, I stopped at my desk and I grabbed my scissors. You know, and I started, I was on his eye. Hey, no cap. You know, I'm, I'm getting I'm gonna get him. But by the time we chasing him out of class, about two, three left, teacher come in. They snatched me up first, like I was the victim. Because I was behind him, chasing him with my scissors, so I looked at like I was the bad one at the time. Because he had dropped his. But by the time the teacher got up in there, that little boy, he was hollering, crying for no reason. I guess he was just so tired and overwhelmed because he knew if he had to stop, I was going to kill him behind my sister. And I'm still this way to this day. Nigga, play with mine. I'm going to come get you. For real. But besides the point, I'm not trying to put out no bad narrative YouTube. But it's just, it's crazy how life goes, you know. And, you know, how, you know, your parents sometimes don't, don't know at the time being you know but i always told her that it was a you know it was a problem that i was overprotective over my my siblings being the youngest i never want to see any any one of them get hurt even though we all me and my brother my blood brother i just showed y'all even though we always we always like felt pain and being hurt you guys right now y'all know what i mean by that real soon you will. I'm going on YouTube.